The Vinton County Lady Vikings faced off against the Gallia Academy Lady Blue Devils in the start of the playoffs. The game got off to a slow start, picking up in the second half. The Vikings started down 17-4 halfway through the second quarter before going on a 15-point run, ending the second quarter at 19 points against Gallia Academy's 22 points. Vinton County came back from halftime rejuvenated and looking phenomenal. Galley Academy shots were not hitting, giving the Vikings a chance to bring the score up. The Vikings were able to take the lead draining buckets. Freshman Emma Maynard put up 22 points with two rebounds, an assist, and two steals. The team definitely had been working on their rebounding, snagging 25 boards. Vinton County was aggressive on the court, grabbing seven steals as well, with head coach Brett Jones clearly following what he had said after the game against the Notre Dame Titans last week that he wanted to be more aggressive on the court. Vinton County stuck with Gallia Academy throughout the whole game, ending the third quarter with Vinton County up by one. In the fourth quarter, the Vikings tied the game up with an assist from Lindsey Riddle, letting Emma Maynard sink a three over two defenders. The Vikings put up the final two points to give them the W following a steal and assist from Emma Maynard leading to a nice layup from freshman Kylie Smith right as the buzzer sounds, finishing the game 48-46. The Vikings were ecstatic over their close win against the Blue Devils, moving ahead to face off against the Uniota Shermans, a matchup which Coach Brett Jones is a little hesitant to play. Obviously respect Uniota, we know what they're about. I mean, 22 and 22 and 0 just doesn't happen. And uh, and I've seen them a few times, and they can play, you know. But we're you know we're going to prepare and we're going to go in uh, and give it our best shot. This is Jack Swizinski from Hardwood Heroes reminding you to be heroic.